Hello Race Gowers, FBB Skittles here, and I'm standing in track number one of Race Gow 2 to have a little discussion about the gate sizes between Race Gow and iGow. So, this question has come up partially because I screwed up and in the video that describes how to build track number one that dropped yesterday, I had a mistake at the bottom of the screen in the editing and I said that in Race Gow 2, the gate sizes were 28 inches and in Race Gow 1, they were 24. When in reality, Race Gow 2 is the 24 inches and Race Gow 1 was 28 inches, which is also what iGow is and will continue to be. Anyway, uh, if you want to uh, be the most competitive in Race Gow 2 this season, and just build the tracks exactly how I'm gonna show them, then you wanna cut your gate, uh, your PVC sections at about 22 and a half inches if you're using three quarter inch PVC and the most typical fittings. That'll give you just over 24 inches center line to center line of your gate, which is the minimum allowed distance. Uh, but you're also allowed to use larger gates you can use the iGow size gates if you already have those PVC cut, which was also from RaceGow 1, which was maximum of 28 inches open. That's inside to inside. So not the center of the gates, but the inside. Uh, that's just based on the cube. Um, or you can use all the way up to 30 inches open for a square, because uh, that's the UWL spec. Anyway, if you do use larger gates, you have to space them a little specifically, which I'm gonna go over now. And if you wanna play Race Scout and you wanna play iGow, or you have in the past, and you already have um, larger the 28 inch size PVC sections cut and you don't wanna buy more, you can still use it for both. But as you'll see, if you have if you use one for the other or one or the other, there'll be disadvantages and advantages either way. So I'll go over that in a second. But uh, let's say you're gonna, you already have 28 inch gates cut for because you played last race gow or you've participated in i gow or both so what you can do is for all the gates the gate one here this gate this gate this gate and this gate and your poles you can use your 28 inch sections the only thing you need to change or you don't even need to do you just need to make sure that this spacing is still 24 inches so don't use one of your gate sections here because that would push it out to 28 inches or like a little like more like 30 and be too it would make it too far so same thing here this distance here needs to be 24 inches no matter what size gate you're using but like the distance from here to here isn't set so if you're using a bigger gate you'll have 24 inches here and then this could be 28 but then you're still going to use this uh, the back side of the gate to line up your other gates. So it'll basically just like make your track a little bigger overall But you can't use it to like get an advantage and space out your gates further Still have to have this specific spacing here and here on this track At 24 inches no matter what size gates you use Okay, I hope that makes sense. So if you think about it, you can still use your race gal gates for iGow or you can use your iGow gates for race gal, but this is kind of how, if you use the iGow gates, you're gonna be at a slight disadvantage for race gal, because it's gonna make your track a little bit bigger uh, overall, which should, I, I guess, equate to slower times. I don't know, maybe it'll be easier for a newer player because the gates will be bigger, but pretty sure for like the fastest pilots, that will be a disadvantage to have bigger gates because it'll just space out your track more overall. And then if you're, if you want to use your race gow gates for eye gow, you could still do that also, but then you'd be at a disadvantage in eye gow because you're typically doing like tricks and flips through the gates. And if you're using a smaller gate, you obviously have less room to like do a flip um, power loop or a Maddie flip or whatever through the gate. So you'd be at a slight disadvantage there, but plenty of eye gow players like Akira who's done very well many times have used smaller gates than the maximum size. Anyway, that's a little discussion on gate sizing. I hope that makes sense and cleared up the mistake that I had on the screen. Um, if you have any more questions, join the Discord and put them there. Um, anyway, good luck and happy whooping.